File seven A. Listening. A. Hello, and welcome to what is a very special show, because we're going to find out the results of our poll. Mike Sandhurst from the BBC is here to tell us who is the greatest Briton of all time. Hello, Mike. Hi there. So let's look at the top five, Mike. All right. Well, number five on the list is, in fact, William Shakespeare. Really? I'm surprised.、Mm, me too. Did you know that nobody knows his date of birth, or that none of his plays were ever published when he was alive? No, I didn't know that. Very interesting and surprising. But who is number four? Well, number four is the scientist Charles Darwin. Ah, yes, Darwin. Tell us something about him. Well, he was born in Shrewsbury on the twelfth of February, eighteen o nine. He was very interested in nature and animals, and was responsible for the theory of evolution. He died in eighteen eighty two at the age of seventy three. Okay, who's next? Number three on the list is Diana, Princess of Wales. Yes, she was popular with a lot of people. That's right. So let me tell you about her. She was born on the first of July, nineteen sixty-one, in a village called Sandringham. She was famous because she was married to Prince Charles, but they weren't happy together, and so they divorced. She died in a car crash in Paris in nineteen ninety-seven. She was only thirty-six years old. Yes, that was a tragic accident. So, number two. Number two is the engineer, Isambard Kingdom Brunel. Really, tell us about him. Well, he was born on the ninth of April, eighteen o six, in Portsmouth. He was responsible for the first British railway, some big ships, and many important bridges and tunnels in Britain. He wasn't very old when he died; only fifty-three. Okay, and now for the moment we've been waiting for: who is the greatest Briton of all time? Who is at the top of the list? Well, I'll give you a clue. It's a man. He was born on the thirtieth of November, eighteen seventy-four, and died in nineteen sixty-five. He was a politician. And he was prime minister not once but twice. I knew it. It's Winston Churchill. That's right. Winston Churchill is the greatest Briton of all time. Mike Sandhurst, thank you so much for joining us. My pleasure.